So what we're going to do is we're going to show you the properties of the water. We purchased some water bottle products from the local supermarket and we purchased some Sprite. This would be the same for any kind of soda, coloured soda, Coca-Cola or anything like that. Uh, but we use Sprite because of the clear nature of the product so we can demonstrate with the tests. So we've taken some tap water from the tap here, we're just going to pour, pour that in. And what we're going to do first of all, we're going to measure the antioxidant nature of these waters. Now what we need to do is remember that anything that oxidises is rusted. If you think about uh, cutting an apple in half, what happens to the apple after a, a little while it goes brown? It's because it's being oxidised. And as we drink and eat oxidants, then our body ages, just like the apple. So I'm just going to pour these waters in the cups, enough so that we can make a demonstration. As you can see, the, I've not opened these bottles before. And this is Sprite. And here we've got uh, the Kangen Water 9.5, which we've taken out of our machine here. So the waters that we've got for our demonstration are Dasani, Aquafina, Smart Water, Fiji Water, and the Sprite, the Kangen Water and the Tap Water. How we measure the oxidisation process uh, is with a metre called an ORP metre, an oxygen reduction potential. And this uh, metre is from a company called American Marine. We're going to use tap water here just to bring it back to normal and I'm just going to show you the ORP of the products that we've got here. Anything which is a plus, which this is a plus, shows you that it's an oxidant. Now here we've got the tap water which is 460, so it's oxidant uh, tap water. This is the Disani water and again you can see that's uh, 477 and rising. Neutralize this. This is the this is the Aquafina and again you can see that it's an oxidant in terms of the OLP. And here we have the smart water Again, it's a plus over 400. And then we go to the Sprite. And again, this represents uh, all of the sodas that we might uh, drink. So this is really quite disturbing because that's oxidizing around 550 plus. And then here we come to the Kangen water, this is Kangen water 9.5 taken from this little machine here and you can see all of a sudden it's going from a plus nature to a negative ORP. So from 400, 500 plus it's now going down to minus, you can see the minus at the um, edge of the screen, currently it's minus 164. 165. So that gives you an idea of the quality of water that we drink from the tap and the water that we drink from bottles. Now there are other dangers to bottled water of course but I'm not going to go into that but um, if you check the website kanganwell.com you will find some information on the dangers that might occur from drinking liquid through plastic. Okay just to recap what we've demonstrated is the antioxidant potential of Kangen water against any other water, tap water, bottled water or soda that we might drink. And just to, to show you again by way of this little graphic here, the plus ORP is bad for us, it, it oxidises, rusts from inside if you like, 
and we get that from purified distilled water, from tap water, from soda. And then as we come along here to the negative aspect, you can see that we get benefits from drinking green tea, cod liver oil, but most definitely from kangen water. And as I've demonstrated, the minus ORP benefit we've got from this kangen water from this small machine here. Please click the links at the end of this video for further demonstrations.